Hi guys! I know I haven't been on social media much and I haven't posted a video in a little bit. Um, it's just been one of those kind of weeks. Uh, yeah, so no excuses, just been a crazy week. And now I'm packing because my husband and I are headed up north Michigan to Tawas, Michigan. And this is going to be the first time that my daughter and my son are home alone and with the responsibility of taking care of all these guys. <laughs> kind of nervous. I know they're going to do a good job. Um, I trust my kids. My daughter is going to be 21 here. Actually, on the, tw right here, on the 23rd, so just next, next week, she'll be tw uh, 21. And my son is 17. So... I trust them. I know they're not going to be throwing no wild parties. Plus, they don't like their friends coming over anyways because of the dogs. <laughs> so, I don't have to worry about that having five dogs. Um, plus, they both work. So, they both, uh, well, my daughter doesn't have to work. So, she'll be home constantly with them while we're gone for two days. And my son has to work tomorrow. So, I know nothing crazy is going to be going on. And their grandparents are like basically right around the corner and come check on them. Uh, if need be, or if there's an, an emergency, um, which I don't think there will be. So, yes, getting away for a couple days to relax with no dogs, no kids, no worries. <laughs> I need some stress relief after this week. Um, anyway, so I thought I'd take you guys along and kind of show you some of the sites um, up north where we go. Um, might not be a lot. Don't know. Hope you guys enjoy it. But we're leaving here in a couple hours. And Mickey's doing good. He's had no problems since he was pretty much good after they gave him his first dose of steroids and um, Benadryl. So he only has to take the steroids now every other day. So he's not going to need another pill till I get home on Sunday. Today's Friday. So... He'll be fine. He took his first one this morning, or his, he took one this morning, so he won't need it tomorrow. He'll need it Sunday. So, my daughter don't have to mess with that. I'm not going to even have her give them their, oh no. Oh no, guys. Oh no. Look who's out there. Okay, the bad kitty's gone. The bad kitty's gone. Yes, he left. Here, you want back up? You aren't going out to get that kitty. No, you're not. Here, you can come up here, though. You can come back up here. He just sits there and stares in the window and taunts these dogs. <laughs> oh, so what was I saying before the mayhem? Um, yeah, so we're leaving in a couple hours, and I thought I'd take you guys along, and I hope you enjoy it. And then I'll also show you how they react when we come home, too. Because a lot of people want to know when we're gone for a couple days how they react when we come home. So, all right. Got to finish packing. <laughs> Magnum. Is he still out there? Is he under the bushes over there? Huh? <laughs>
Okay, guys, let me show you what I got at Bronner's. Oh, I'm so excited, guys. I it was, I love Bronner's, you guys. <laughs> I need to go back without my impatient husband, <laughs> my daughter and I. I saw so many things I wanted to get, and all he sees is dollar signs adding up. Okay, this is the first thing I got. Let me see if I can pick up the camera and show you. You know those porcelain trees that everybody's grandma had? Well, my husband and I wanted to get one, but they had green ones. We didn't want green, so we got this white one here. That was $39.99. Okay, let me set this down. I'll take it out of the box and show you. Let me move a chair. Hopefully I got enough battery. I haven't charged my battery on my phone. <clears throat> but they had so many dog ornaments you guys I couldn't show you some for you to give your vet some to give your if you have a dog walker your groomer there were so many ornaments pet related even cats too I mean there's an ornament for anything in there I'll tell you you think of it you'll find it I bought one for my husband one time uh, he's a realtor and Got him a realtor ornament. <laughs> I'm so excited to set this on my end table this Christmas. Okay, I think there's a star somewhere. I think it's in here. Yeah, there's a star that sits on top of this too. I'm not going to take it out. It's all packaged. But let me give you a close up. Just picture a star on top. And most people have the green one, but I liked the white one. So there's that, and okay, I'm going to move this to the side and show you the dog related ornaments I got. One of them is going to be for a giveaway in uh, December, so make sure you subscribe if you want to win my Christmas um, gi uh, giveaway I'm going to have. I'm going to have one soon too, you guys, for... Um, when I hit 5,000 subscribers, I think I'm about 300 people away. So let's hope we get there soon because I've got a nice, I have a big uh, doggy basket full of stuff to give away when we hit 5,000 subscribers. Okay. This is by, looks like Noble Gems, exclusively by Kurt S. Aldler Designers. This is a handcrafted glass ornament. Okay, let me come up to the camera so I can show you. I don't want to drop it. It's a schnauzer with reindeer antlers. I'm scared to... Okay, hold on. Let's move this. I don't want to drop the thing. <laughs> okay, how can I hold this? Okay, I think I got a good enough grip. Can you guys see that? So cute! They had one too. This was... How much was this? $16.99, I believe. Yeah, $16.99 for that. They had a Schnauzer one that was like, it looked like a Count Dracula. It, it was kind of weird. I, I didn't really, I, I mean, I was going to get it just because it was a Schnauzer, but then I thought, I don't really like this one. What am I getting it for? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it had like a cape on, and it just, it was kind of weird for a Christmas ornament. But, anyway, and then... Um, they had uh, the one I got at Hobby Lobby there, so they had that one too, but I already have it from Hobby Lobby, so I did not get that. And then I got just this bulb here. It says Dog Mom. And this was $10.99. And then I got this one for my giveaway. And I know, I know all of you that watch my channel do not own schnauzers, but I am a schnauzer mom and I have five and I thought the ones that do, um, it's got glitter everywhere, with like a schnauzer ornament. So I got, because I already have this one, so I got a I love my schnauzer ornament for you guys in December. So make sure you subscribe if you want to win this one plus uh, another one I have. And I might add more stuff because I'm crazy. <laughs> I'm a crazy person when it comes to dog stuff. So that's what I got at Bronner's. So we were only in the store maybe half hour. You need a good couple hours. I, 
they have a cafe in there that tells you you can be in there forever looking at ornaments in that place you have to look it up online um, I'll put the link below for Bronner's and you'll see how humongous this place is and the choices of bulbs and Christmas stuff you can get there so yeah we were only in there for about a half an hour and I could have been in there long I could have sat there to eat lunch and then looked some more let me tell you <laughs> but my husband's not a shopper like that and you know I'm sure anybody else who has husbands their husbands probably aren't shop shoppers like that either so I'm gonna figure out how to put this back in so I can put it back in the box till Christmas so there you always go there's my brownie salt and I'll show you what I got in Tawas nothing uh, spectacular hold on Okay, sorry, I had to get it out of my bag. Um, uh, this bag. Now, anybody who's in Michigan knows when you go up North Michigan, you gotta get a hoodie, sweatshirt, something. So, I got a, the Point East Tawas. It's a hoodie, it's green. And I got myself a zip-up hoodie. It's gray. And... Oh, this is the wrong hoodie, guys. Hold on, guys. Well, I don't know where it is. It must be in my dirty clothes. Because I did wear it one night, so it probably is. It's just another gray um, hoodie, but it zips up, and it says uh, Tawas on it. So that's what I got in Tawas. I got my kids a hoodie. My husband got some t-shirts. I got my daughter a... When we went to the lighthouse, I got her a bottle that was filled with a little bit of sand and seashells because she likes to do that whenever we go somewhere on the Great Lakes. She'll get a little uh, bottle with a cork on top from the craft stores and she puts sand and uh, rocks and, or little rocks and uh, seashells in it from where we go. And we're going in October to uh, Mackinac, in Mackinac, Mackinac City and Mackinac Island. So if you guys want me to videotape some stuff from there, um, I will. Just let me know in the comments. So I'm really excited about going to Mackinac. Let's see if I can get it back in. Really excited about going to Mackinac Island. It's so beautiful there, you guys. So beautiful. I love Mackinac. So we haven't been there since... I think my daughter was in junior high and my son was in elementary. And now my son is a senior in high school this year. And my daughter, uh, she turns 21 here in a couple days. She's in her... Uh, third third year of college fourth year third third year oh gosh gosh time is going by and I don't know but anyways I hope you guys like seeing what I got we had a good time and I hope you guys like a little bit of footage I don't even know what I got yet I gotta look at it but I hope you like the footage I got I'm not a professional vlogger so I don't know what I got so anyways talk to you in a minute <laughs>
Sorry, guys, I'm laughing at you. <laughs> Sorry, boys. You guys are just so silly. <laughs> Max, you make me laugh so much. You're just so funny the way you play. <laughs> well, back from our little, my husband and I's little mini vacay and things are back. Just how they always were. Sitting. This one's up in the window. Sitting and watching the boys act crazy. Not getting nothing done. Not putting stuff away. Stuff out there. Back to the same old, same old. Got Irby sitting over here. I need to put up my purse. They're just so entertaining. <laughs> Bye, guys.